Big Travel Channel offers travel video guides for more than 20 cities in Asia, US, and Canada. If you like our travel videos, subscribe to this channel to see more. Portland, Oregon Portland Japanese Garden The Japanese Garden is located in Washington Park near downtown Portland. By car, set your GPS to 611 Southwest Kingston Avenue. Arrive before 10 a.m. for parking nearest the Japanese Garden. You will find paid parking throughout the park. Pay at the vending machines using a credit or debit card. If you intend to stay at the park more than four hours, pay for the whole day. If you're using public transportation to the Japanese Garden, take the TriMet Max red or blue line that goes towards Beaverton Hillsboro from downtown to the Portland Zoo. Exit the Max at the Washington Park stop and take the elevators up to the zoo area. Walk to the free Washington Park shuttle stop and take a purple shuttle, offered weekends and daily in summer, to the Japanese Garden stop. The shuttle will drop you off near the Japanese Garden and International Test Rose Garden. The Japanese Garden is located north of the tennis courts. The garden is open at 12 on Mondays only and at 10 a.m. on all other days. Follow the signs to the Japanese Garden. You will walk up a small woody hill to the entrance. A free shuttle is available at the bottom of the hill. Tickets can be purchased at the entrance of the garden at the ticket booth. The garden has a strict photo policy. Please check with them for specifics. The Japanese garden is five acres. It features an antique gate, pavilion, tea house, moon and zigzag bridge. The garden was designed to show the balance of plants, stones, and water. The garden is full of peaceful pathways surrounded by calm landscapes. Five Japanese garden styles are highlighted. You can spend an hour or more depending on your interest. Combine with the free International Test Garden or any other attraction in Washington Park. Happy travels! Go to hipfig.com for more information or go to our HipFig Travel Channel on YouTube and be sure to subscribe for regular updates.